Hey everyone, Taco Mentor here. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to fix notification sound not working after iOS 26 update on your phone. So let's get started. The very first thing is you wanna make sure your phone is not on do not disturb by any chance. So usually this could be by the action button. If you have the action button here or the toggle, you wanna basically press if it's action button to make sure it's not in silent mode by long pressing it again. Or if the toggle is downward, you wanna put it upward. That's gonna be the first thing. The next thing to do is going into your setting and then going to the actual sounds and haptics. From sounds and haptics here, you also might see a silent mode. I'm gonna turn that off. And then make sure here your ringer volume is turned up. If it's up down, you wanna move it up. And then for each of these options, you wanna make sure you have something selected. For example, ringtone. Now you wanna make sure it's selected instead of none same with text tone you want to make sure it's not none you want to select to default on one of these and for each of the settings you want to verify they have a sound now along with that the next thing you want to do is for the main settings you're going to go to notification this time and for each of the notification app you want to make sure it is turned on and didn't get turned off for example if i wanted notification from maybe ESPN, I would allow this. Now, if it's already allowed and you're not getting any notification, turn it off and then turn it back on. And you're gonna do it for each app that you're having issues. Maybe you're having issues with messages, so you turn it off and then turn it back on. And that's gonna re-enable the message notification sounds. Again, go ahead and verify for each of the app to make sure it is working. If it's still not working, the next thing to do is go ahead and follow the step here and quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold down this big side button. So I'm gonna do volume up, volume down, and then I hold down this big side button, just like that. In that sequence, again, quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold down that big side button until the screen goes completely black and you see Apple logo appear at that time, you'll let go. And that's gonna go ahead and force restart the phone which basically shuts down the phone software and then reloads the code. So if it's a software related issue, it's gonna go ahead and fix it for you. This method will not delete any of your data. Again, if it doesn't work the very first time, go ahead and try again. Quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold down that side button. Now let's say you're back on the phone, it's still having issues. The next thing you wanna go ahead and check out is that your phone is not on do not disturb. So pull down or pull up the control menu and then where it says right here, if it's on do not disturb, you want to turn that setting off. Other thing you also want to verify is your Bluetooth is not turned on. So in your setting, Bluetooth, make sure it's not connected to another device as that notification will go to that device instead of ringing from your phone. Now, if you're still having issues, the next thing to do is in your setting, Go to general, software update, and make sure your phone is up to date with the latest iOS version, as previous version might have caused issues with your phone. So by following these steps, I hope your notification sound is working again. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.